Hey everyone, we're here at Honeysuckle Farms in Springfield, Tennessee. They have a ton of activities for the kids out here, nighttime fireworks, just lots to offer. So let's go check it out. Let's go. Here's a look at their map here. They have lots to offer here. Apple blasters, tire mountain, zip line, corn maze, hay rides. There's a fun house, grandma's kitchen, duck pond, I think you name it. There you have it. Why did you come in? You'll see the farm market, which is their shop there. There's the map we just showed you, and there's the parking lot there. And immediately to the left, you'll see a cool photo op with the truck there, hay bales and pumpkins, and then there's your ticket line. Uh, even if you buy your tickets online, you still have to get a wristband, so you do have to wait in line for that. Uh, but you can buy them online. I'm not sure if you can buy them here in person, but you, either way you have to get a uh, wristband. And then off to the left there is uh, group sales. As we're coming in, you can see the prices here. So there's $17.95 or $19.95. We did confirm you can buy tickets here. There's everything your tickets include. So pumpkin cannon, hay ride, petting farm, corn maze, lots of different things it includes there. And there's some of the show times there. Uh, pig race, fire truck, cannon show, all that. All right, we just got in and there's a photo op right when you come in. Looks like a really cool photo op here. And then just to give you a look around here, there's food right there to that long line is for. Uh, there's a back 40 playground back there. The fun house is right there. And that's where we just came from, the long line there. And Hey Steph, <laughs> there's Steph at the photo op. There's the fun house entrance. So it's pretty cool. There's a barn straight ahead to your right is that little market we saw when we came in. And they've already got a whole bunch of pumpkins out here you can pick. You can pick all these pumpkins out here. White pumpkins, orange pumpkins. The chair there in front of us, and then there's also a kettle corn there as well. <laughs> All right, there's Jer and Dad Nerd. The big old chair. There's a look at the market again. Look at this giant swing they have here. Another good photo op right there. You can see it fits like five, six people easily. Pumpkins all over the place. They have a really cool carousel right there. And there's the big chair there, another photo op. And they got a photo op right there as well with the, the hay and the pumpkins. And they have this one right here too. There's the kettle corn booth there. They also have pretzels as well. There's the candy cannon. I think it looks really cool. And then here is the pumpkin hopper. Looks like just kind of an inflatable thing on the ground there for kids to jump in. Kind of like a jump house. Off of the distance, there's some swings. Like your typical fair swings that kind of go in a circle. And then the zip lines are right there. Some little drum things for the kids there. There's a tent so you can go under there in the shade and eat. And here's the back 40 smoke shack. Corn dogs, barbecue, nachos, um, hamburgers looks like, chili dogs. There's another one called the corn popper over there for kids for them to jump on as well. A little A's bubble hut which is there I'm assuming. And there's the zip line. A little general store out here. There's a little photo op there. It's a little windmill and a little inflatable pumpkin. So there's a zip line going right there in the background. That's cool. 
And we're looking for the corn maze now. So let's head this way here. And there's, there's a flower patch ahead of us. And we're looking for the corn maze now. There's the Hunter's Challenge course. It's like all kinds of obstacles there to climb through, play through for kids. Looks really interesting. And there's a big mountain of tires right there. Climb on, go slide on it. There is like a little spider web thing there. And they have apple blasters over here. You kind of hear like some of like gunshots with actually apple blasters. There's the zip line going across. More things for the kids to play on. And they have a whole treehouse village down here as well. That looks really neat. And then they have another big slide over here as well. And that goes down the hill there. This is the tires you can climb on here. It has the slide too. We're on top of the hill now. There's the pipe slide hill that we just showed you. The pumpkin train. And then one of our favorite things to do is the corn maze. Uh, just to show you here, pumpkins are 49 cents per pound and the Pumpkin Express light show runs from dark to 8 p.m. on Saturdays only. That sounds pretty cool. And then Nashville's Country Music Corn Maze. And here's the rules of the maze. All right, we're heading on in. And as you head in, look at these beautiful sunflowers right here. And you can pick the flowers here as well. That's really cool. As you can see off in the distance, there's the corn maze ahead of us. We're in the corn maze now. So we're going to fall along the path here. And we'll see if we can make our way back out of here. The paths here are well worn, lots of corn knocked down, so it is getting close to the end of the season in here. All right, hey, there's Steph behind us, and we got Dad and they're way back there in the back, and we're making our way through the maze, uh, trying to find how to get out of here. Yeah. If you see this video, we made it out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We'll make it out. Hope so. Dad's trick of the most well-worn path probably is not going to work this time. But we're still making our way through. That way it looks like a dead end. Definitely more crops there. I'm going left. We still beat you. Hey, Jimmy, I think we should go this way. Stephanie thinks we should go another way. So I guess we're going to turn back around and then follow Steph. And then we're going to make a left right here. Hey, Steph. Hey. Which way, Steph? So, so it's starting to feel like a horror movie. I don't know if she's right behind you can hear. There's a way to the left. I think we're going to the right. Keep going straight. We slow down. We gotta wait for Dad Nerd. Dad Nerd is trailing behind us somewhere. There's also a lot of these little paths like this. We can squeeze through. We'll head this way here. Oh wow, this is really cool. This is a huge mage, maze. Um, I guess that's the path. <laughs> Are you kidding? Steph led us on a tiny little path here. They may be off the beaten path, but I am Heading through here. 
Oh, leads right over to this path. That's cool. Hear me. All right. There's stuff coming out of the path now. <laughs> For some reason, we're the only people out here in the maze of this part of it. A little strange, but still pretty cool. Maybe we took a wrong turn in Albuquerque. Did you say what? So we took a wrong turn in Albuquerque, maybe. <laughs> That's a big spider. Uh. We're looking to our left and our right. I guess we'll go left. And there's like a little tiny path right there, and then the main path this way. So now we got three decisions. Which way, Steph? Right, probably? Yeah. So you go left, straight, and Steph says go right. Yeah. Alright, we're going to turn right, and just for a point of reference, Steph has a cheat sheet in her pocket apparently. I didn't know about this. We know now. <laughs> but there's a cool look at the maze there, Loretta Lynn. And oh. even with this little map, uh, we're still lost. You definitely get turned around in here. And just to show you above the maze there. There's corn everywhere. What pretty flower. Which way, Steph? I don't know. Get me out of here. So left. Some of these paths are really closed in. Makes it pretty cool. This will go right. We have a little prickly stuff on this thing. That's really cool. Watch out for the prickles. And there's that nerd. He's creeping through the corn stalks. <laughs> Alrighty, we're almost to the front. It looks like the zip line keeps getting closer. Pretty cool maze so far. Uh, Steph, I don't know where she went to. Maybe in the corn. Somewhere. <laughs> we'll find her. Alright, we made it out of the corn maze. What do you think, Steph? Uh, it was amazing. <laughs> it went pretty quick, actually. So we enjoyed that, and we're gonna. Keep checking out the place here. It's pretty awesome so far. Pretty cool. <laughs> we found Dad playing with some pots here. <laughs> <laughs> We're at the flower patch now. We're heading in. So it's card only. $20 per vase. And then $2 per flower if you don't get the vase option. Cool little thing. They put the water in your vases. And so if you do the vase options, as many as you can fit in there. Look at all these beautiful flowers right here as you walk in. Um, or if you don't want to do the vase option for $20, you can pay $2 per flower. Absolutely beautiful flowers right here in the front. Look at this red and purple right here. Wow. This is the ball zone here. So there's barnyard football and basketball. So you can just shoot some hoops or throw some footballs. The zip line again. And there's a second zip line tower. And then it goes all in the trees. Can't really see the third zip line tower right now. There's a rock climbing wall. And then there's those big rocking chairs to get your photo in. Lots to offer out here. 
are passing by the kids' zip line. It's at the bottom of the adult zip line. So it's really cool that they have that. And there's a little area right here for kids to rock like little tricycles. Those look pretty cool. Another little photo op right here behind us. There's a minor mountain, the bigger slide. Cool little wagon there. And then there's the tornado, not from the distance. That's like the little swings you find at the fair, like the little uh, uh, chain link swings. Swings. And we're on the back side, got the little bouncy thing here. Another little slide and little tunnel for kids to play in. And then off in the distance, there's two tractors. Uh, both have slides and swings on them uh, for the kids. So if you have little ones, I know we're big kids, but lots and lots of things to do for the little kids here. All right, we're in the fun house now. <laughs> it literally is pitch black in here, except for a few black lights. Watch your step. There's a few black lights. Watch your step again. Oh, it's a mirror at the end. It's a dead end. Oh, it's a dead end. Oh, you gotta open the door. What? No. Oh, we had to open the door. That was cool. There's actually a door. And so what y'all are seeing is how dark it is. It's pitch black. There's a door <laughs> open. <laughs> John. <laughs> that was dad nerd. Look at these lights and these eyeballs. Yeah, look at these. Wow. Oh, we have a clown room coming up. I don't know if people oh actually God, scare you in here or not, but this is still really cool. This may just be a fun house with no scares. There's a curtain here. Oh, the, the floor is crooked sideways. There's some chains hanging on the ceiling here. I don't see anybody scaring anybody, so I think it was just a walk through. I mean, sorry, but it's hard to see. It's almost pitch black, except for a few black lights in here. That was a mirror right there again. <laughs> hey, everybody, if you can see me. Oh, stars, another curved mirror. Oh, it's dark in here now. Whoa. Whoa! There's a huge, a huge step up. Oh, we got a fun tunnel. Look at this. We got a fun tunnel. Go Alright, we're gonna sh show stuff going through the tunnel. Oh god. <laughs> oh my god. There's Steph. So we're gonna follow. Whoa. It's it makes you feel like you're spinning. Steph made it through. Look at that tunnel. Look at that. That's cool right there. What's that? Is that a wall? And then, yeah, this is where you go. No, you go this way. Oh, no, it's a dead end right there. Black oh, lights. Did you see that? Whoa. That's creepy. It's a really cool clown pan on the wall, but you can barely see it. Oh, whoa, huge drop off. Whoa. That's a huge drop down the pitch black. Uh, <laughs> there's clown tent all around us. Oh. <laughs> oh, we're in the same room again. It's clown tents, like clown tent all around us. <laughs> it's another one. Oh, it's a dead end. What? It's, it's a dead end. Steph. Oh, we're stuck. <laughs> Other stuff's face. Thank you, Dad Nerd. Dad Nerd's in here with us, too. I feel like it's pretty cool. There's tents and curtains everywhere. We're lost in here. Oh, Steph found it. Oh, look at this mirror. There's Steph dancing here, everybody. There's Dad Nerd. Hey, Dad Nerd. Look how tall and thin we are. Look at your shirt, Lily. 
Oh, my shirt does glow in the dark, so let's do a. See my shirt glow in here? That's actually my shirt glows in the dark. It's the Boo Crew shirt from Bucky's. <laughs> I can't see Daddy's too too dark in here to see. And another dark room here. And, yep, and we're back out the exit now. Whoa, that was awesome. All right, we scaled the fun house. Uh, we could film in there, which is pretty cool. Yeah. There's no one like scaring you. Uh, I think it was there were spots for them though to be to scare you. So I don't know, maybe they will. Yeah, maybe different hours or something. Yeah. But that was amazing, actually. There's like yeah. a, like the clown tents. I can see a killer, killer clowns or clown like a, or a clown talking at a fair. Yeah. And there was like five or six rooms you go through. All you can do is just barely turn around. It's almost like you're getting lost every time. Black lights and mirrors. Uh, the floors were different levels and uh, just really well done. It's really cool. It was really cool. I had yeah. a really good time. That really was, awesome that was a good with that. Job. They did yeah. That well. There was some really long lines of the food. Then we noticed there's Grandma's Country Kitchen here. You get chicken tenders, a cheeseburger, or a hot dog. Bless you. And you get a side with it. There's the menu there. And there's literally no line back here. So it's cashless though, card only. You pay it right there at the little tablet there. And the nice lady there taking your order. And then you have all these tables and space back here to eat at. So we're getting some food from here. We just got our food. Show you a quick look at it. There's the kettle chips and chicken tenders, uh, mac and cheese and the hot dog. So look at all our food together. We'll give it a try now. All right, we just got done with our food and it was pretty good. Chicken tenders are good, hot dog was good. Uh, your average food like a fair or something like that, but still pretty good. We enjoyed it and uh, we're gonna check out the rest of the event has the offer here. Here's the haystack maze. It's a little smaller maze for the kids there. And then here is the petting farm. And we're gonna head into the petting farm area now and see the animals. There's a look there at part of the little maze, haystack maze, the milking parlor. Look at that cool fire truck there. Fire truck, it looks like it shoots pumpkins. There's a milking parlor, it's not open right now, but it kind of teaches you how to milk cows. That's really cool. And the sun is starting to set. It's beautiful out here. These are the sheep here. But they're all kind of back there. Oh wow. Like really cool. That's some cool looking sheep. And here's a little nothing in these barns here. Uh oh. There's singing chickens coming up. Oh yeah. Here is the singing chicken show. <laughs> Frizzle chicken in uh, Gatlinburg. Uh, Pigeon Forge area is on our list to go to. And heading over here now for the goats. There's the goats here. Some more cool goats. There's some little things that goats to play on there. Now we're gonna head back over here to the rest of the petting farm area. Heading up here, this is Bo, Bo and Luke, Scottish Highland Bulls. Wow. This looks awesome, everyone. Look at that bull. This is Bo and Luke. It's Bo and Luke. Bo and Luke. Look at them. Wow. I was gonna hold it here for a few minutes. Let y'all take this in. This is so cool to see these up close. Wow. That's really cool. Uh, there's a cool like log cabin. It's probably where the owners live, I'd imagine. And there's a calf over here. Is 
This is Otis the calf. And some hay bales here. And another photo op up here, and they got some donkeys up here too. Another cool photo op there. And then Clyde and Nelly, the donkeys. Oh, the donkey's coming to see us. Hello, Mr. Donkey. And then the other donkey is behind the hay bale. We can't really get a good look, but there's half a donkey. Pretty cool. We're back out front of the haystack maze now. It's another cool slide they had here. This one looks like a spider. That's pretty cool. You got a big uh, wooden horse there. And there's some swings. Off in the distance, some cover wagons, and a little area, kids area for the kids to play at. Some more playground stuff there. And then some wood, a fire pit over here. They do have other fire pits. And look how awesome this looks over here. With all the lights and everything. Wow. The lights come on. This looks beautiful. The beautiful sunset and the cool lights. Wow. And look at that. They got a tractor running right there for a photo op. Dad nerd on a horse. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, he's riding the horse. <laughs> of course, Jeremy has to try, has to get on the horse as well. So here Jer goes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, back here at the entrance of Tiny Town, and there's Dad Nerd. Gonna crank. He's gonna get it started for us. <laughs> there it goes. That's a really cool photo op that you actually can crank the handle and turn on. That's awesome. And over here is the party pavilion. Owl train ride. That's cool. And then over here, a little bit of a lake off in the distance. You have a little stand there for some drinks, it looks like. And they call it the party pavilion. Well, oh, there's a birthday party in there, so I'm assuming you can rent that out uh, for birthday parties or anything else you have going on. And I think there's some fire pits off in the distance we're going to check out. And the fireworks here in a little bit. Here next to the carousel. And at nighttime, it looks beautiful. And right over to our right is the fire pit area. Just to let you know, fire pits are $50. So you get a fire pit, it looks like a little table there next to it. Uh, you can get them online in advance. They do sell out, they said. So it's best, like today when we got here, the fire pits were sold out. So it's best to get them ahead of time. Uh, but you get a little fire pit and you get a table next to it. So just kind of walk into the fire pit area now. So you can just see them all over the place here. And they light them for you and everything, so there's nothing you have to actually do besides uh, literally just be here. And it smells amazing over here. And so that's the fire pit area. There's probably like a good 20-ish fire pits in there. And it's $50 at the time of this video uh, to get a fire pit and um, Recommended to do it online. They were sold out when we got here. You can't do it when you get here, but it could be sold out Look at this barn here. This looks uh, awesome so There's just tables in here some music playing and a bunch of tractors This looks really cool in here This whole place has been amazing and There's a bunch more pumpkins over here They're heading back towards that carousel and then there's a look at the whole fire pit area there. You can see all the fire pits kind of in the distance there. Alright everyone, you just saw the fire pits over there. We're about to go check out the fireworks show. It's getting started right as we're talking here. Let's go check it out.
little bit dark, but uh, we got a pretzel to eat here. Looks really good in its little dark, and they also have a uh, apple cider slushies. Gotta sounds be festive. Sounds really good, and we also got some fudge too. So we're gonna eat some snacks and probably head out here soon. Alrighty, we just got done out here at Honey Suckle Farm in Spring uh, Bill, Tennessee. And wow, what an amazing time. We had a blast drinking our apple cider slushy now, which is really good. It's very good. It's just like applesauce, really. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like a slushy version of apple cider. It's amazing. It's really good. Uh, a 16 minute fireworks show. Are we at 4th of July or New Year's? I don't know, but that was awesome. <laughs> and they had a fun house here. Uh, there's no like jump scares in the fun house, but really well done fun house. Uh, man, this whole place is awesome. What do you think, Steph? Yeah, we had a really good time. The fun house was awesome. It's way more than I expected for a pumpkin farm. Um, they did a really good job with it. The fireworks, I thought they would never end. I wasn't expecting a 16 minute fireworks show um, yeah. here, but it was really good. It was really good. We enjoyed it. It was amazing. This is one of the yeah. best ones we've ever been to. We had a blast here. It's our first time here. Yeah. But we'll definitely be coming back. So yep. check it out. Uh, let us know in the comments what you think below. and. Be sure to like and subscribe, hit that bell, and we'll see you soon. Bye, guys. Bye, everybody.